Okay, good morning. Focus. Beautiful looking morning here. Yes. I see you there. Come here. <laughs> see, somebody's adopted me. How you doing? I'll watch eye to her favorite chair. You see the chair at the tree there. So that's me working. Mama Ochai relaxing under a tree, enjoying herself. No laptop, no phone, no internet, no social media. Just watching the sea and the beach, and enjoying her day. So who's having the best day? <laughs> I think I know. I should also add, for the record, Mama Ochai already did her chores this morning, spent about two hours sweeping all long hair. 84 years young. Bless. I have to say though, damn it's hard to work here. <laughs> ah well, back on the edit. Not complaining. Not complaining. For anybody who hasn't seen it, here's a quick tour of the room. Aircon. A couple of windows. Bathroom. Big bed. Fridge. <laughs> and that view. Mamo Chai's Sare Beach. Now let's go stretch the legs. Oh, my office. Not bad. Oh, also did my laundry chores already. Let's go. I think Mamo Chai's probably has the nicest setting of any property on this entire beach, really. And as a bonus, you've got Mamo Chai for herself. Absolutely stunning. <laughs> Nothing more to add. Kun Dot, he just, I just ran into him on the beach and he's offered to take me to Nanguan Island. Taxi boat? Okay, Kapkuma, Kapkuno. Perfect. Idyllic looking bungalows, beachfront bungalows there. And probably the most upscale and exclusive property on the beach. Right here, Cabana. Beautiful setting. Midday, so it's extremely quiet here. But I imagine they will get some covers for dinner tonight. There's the best seat of the house, isn't it? Well, every seat is a great seat in this house. One last look. Wow. Let's go. I'd love to get up to that infinity pool, but it looks like it's attached to that private villa right there. And what a view they must have. That cabana. Check out the view. Worth whatever price they're charging. <laughs> noticed when I said villa just now that's the price differential the increment goes up when, when the price goes up above say 3,000 baht or hundred dollars then you move up from say bungalows to villas these are gorgeous I'm happy where I am too beautiful grounds beautiful property Wow some of these villas are right out of J.R. Tolkien meets Jungle Book. <laughs> Fantastic. Right, and we're back through the back path to the beach. How incredible is that? 
cold beer, a pillow, and that hammock. Perfect. <laughs> Let's go. Here's a place that's doing some preparations. I like the choice of tunes. Yeah, there will be people getting massaged at the beach very soon as well. Coming soon. Trying. I'm asking here. There's a lady phoning somebody. Please, hopefully we get lucky. What are you having some fun? <laughs> In the tidal pool, like a little kid. Watch a gate. Watergate. Come see this nice lady. She just found me a boat. Maybe my ride. <laughs> what do you got? Perfect timing. Couldn't go. Boat, you know, it got. Okay. He's saying I've got to. We've got to get there and back by five. I think we can do it. It'll be worth it. Skookum looking boat. That's a Canadian expression, by the way. Skookum means in good nick. Uh oh. He's cranking. Let's hope it fires up. A little gas. Come on. Sari Beach and Momo Chai is right behind us. And we're off. <laughs> Fantastic. I just love it when a plan comes together. <laughs> Wanna be real careful where you oh, where you put those props. want to keep your friends around here, you slice up their lines and you're going to be Johnny No-Mates very quickly. <laughs> Stop Johnny No-Mates. You can see how shallow the reef is here. See that reef marker, you know, how tight it is to the left and right. It's literally the width of this boat. Lek lek! I did it. Thread of the needle, and we're safely out to sea. Dang one, dead ahead. I to like to live in one of those houses. I think I said that in the last time I was on my way to Nang one a few months ago. I looked back at my previous hotel bit. Nang one is actually two islands. there and then travel down there as well. It's gonna be gorgeous, you'll see. This water, it's windy but you can see right to the bottom. It's gotta be 20 meters deep you can still see the bottom. Wish I could have filmed that. I jumped up there did a one hop off. If you miss it in my last Kotal vid I was put out of the boat the other side of that island and there was no ramp <laughs> so the boat had gone he didn't realize it anyways I found a way up but it was a bit of a cliffhanger <laughs> it's much easier this time we're in the wind noise last time I was here it was extremely windy as well and we're off to the top of that hill Let's go. See by the high tide mark, the gauge of, of uh, how high the tide does come here. How amazing is this beach? Something straight out of Robinson Crusoe, doesn't it? <laughs> Just look at that water. 
How gorgeous is that? Mm. By the way, you can stay in these bungalows. If I can find the rates in the park website, I'll, or in the island website, I'll list it right now. stayed the night and went back the next afternoon and be an absolutely perfect little side trip from uh, Kotel and Sari Beach, etc. Yeah, I mean, just imagine being on that balcony right there watching the sun go down as the last boat departs in your private little island here. That would be fantastic. Assuming you're well stocked up with beer, of course. <laughs> Okay, even though the other side was may have seemed windy, that was actually the leeward side, or the non-windy side. This is the windward side, as you can see the chop there. But, we're heading up, a thousand steps or so. <laughs> I got this. <sighs> yeah, I got this. It's got me. Don't throw bottles. Oh, before it said don't bring bottles. Don't bring plastic. Hmm. Okay, getting near the top. Danger, do not climb the top rock. Of course I will. On the official trail is the unofficial non-trail. Just up these rocks. You do want to exercise a, a bit of caution coming up these rocks, obviously. <laughs> the big reveal coming up. In five, four, three, two, one. Nangwon Island. If you're thinking Fantasy Island, I wouldn't blame you, but it's real. <laughs> this in itself is worth visiting Kotao on top of a myriad of other reasons. Sorry, I'm breathless after climbing up this hill. Okay, let's go wide angle. Okay, wide angle it drops to 30 frames per second from 60. Sorry about that, so it'll be a little choppier. It gives you a, a better, wider view. Right, have to get going unfortunately. Island closes in about 30 minutes. Let's go down to the other beach. Let's go. Oh, by the way, here's the backdrop. Also incredible. Hmm. Let's go. Be a wee bit careful going down here. Made it down. Back on the boardwalk. Under the boardwalk. Boardwalk. Cut! <laughs> wow. Just effing wow for the second time today. Water. It's not gorgeous. And again, down by the uh, tide line, it's a bit of coral. It's soft coral. It's not jagged coral. And at the top of the beach, it's very nice white sand. Pretty sure my ferryman's waiting, so I better get back. Parting shot of idyllic Nang Wan. 
Those people that work here, they're going off with fishing rods. So that's what they do after five. Damn it, how do I apply to for a job here? <laughs> good on them. Thank you, Nangwon Island. Yes, it was. A good journey indeed. See you again. It's a place I would definitely come back to. Because I still haven't climbed that hill over there. Next time. I think I said that last time. Let's go. Lots of little fish around here. This way to the pier. This is the gangway. Damn, I want to go fishing. There's an abundance of little fish around here. That means there must be an abundance of bigger fish. Feel waiting on the end of my life. Very beautiful. Wow. Every time. Amazing. Still fishing. Playa. Yeah. Oh, there's a couple of big ones in there. Look at that. Damn it. <laughs> I absolutely love fishing. It's something I hardly ever get to do anymore. How clear that water is despite the depth. The fish are following us. What the hell? <laughs> I feel like a dolphin. Like dolphins can swim. There's a David Bowie song in there somewhere. <laughs> we could be heroes. Okay, no more singing today. Or non-singing. Another observation. I don't know if you can see or hear again, but I'll try to zoom in here. Looks like there's a fair bit of deforestation happening in the just in between those two peaks there. I hope not. Because when you when you take the trees off the hillside, well the, the hillside usually follows. Maybe a lesson to be learned. We'll see. Absolutely stunning coming into Surrey Beach, isn't it? Isn't that gorgeous or what? Never get used to this. The tides come in a bit, but the captain's got to really thread the needle here. You can see he's trying to just nail this between there and there. Literally the width of this boat, this opening between these. Well, that's what you're looking at. Jagged coral and rocks. And he threads the needle perfectly, of course. Cut the motor. And we're just drifting into the beach. I said I could just walk it or swim it. He's giving full service all the way into the beach. Come, come, come! Thank you. I'm just grateful he came out of the spur of the moment like that. This dog is still playing around like a kid in a tidal pool. Oh, he's got a kid to play with too, good. <laughs> Woohoo! Love this little track, it leads to Momo Chai's main road. Ah, we might get a sunset tonight. I think we're in luck. Oh, unless it goes behind those clouds. And here's what I'm aiming for. The sunset. Blue water. This will do. Watermelon tequila. It's off the hook. Fantastic. Okay. <laughs> I'd say dinner's complete.
Here's the 360. Pretty chill. Folks are enjoying the evening. And the sun, she's gone for another day. And on that note, before I get another copyright strike, I think I'll just say thanks for watching. I'll leave it there. I'll see you in the next one. Hope you all can get back here soon. Next one will probably be a travel day. Hope you watch it. Cheers. In five, four, three, two, one. Nangwon Island. If you're thinking Fantasy Island, I wouldn't blame you.